sitting hip rotations. So I want you to be in this, this hip angle, roughly around 90 degrees, hands on the floor. Thread your feet apart. But what I want you to do is I want you to isolate pure hip rotation in this position. So if we're going to go the left knee is going to go into, or left leg is going to go into extra rotation. I'm going to move that knee all the way out to the side as far as I can. And only at the hip, if my right butt cheek lifts up, I can go a lot farther. But if I keep that left, that right butt cheek down, the left leg can only go so far. But what I'm trying to do is isolate that motion at the hip. Now I'm also going to do that internal rotation too. So if I bring that left knee inwards, I'm trying to isolate that motion at the hip, this left butt cheek can't lift up. If at any point it lifts up, I can go a lot farther. But if I'm going to pin it down, now we isolate that motion in the hip joint into internal rotation. If you're lacking extra rotation or internal rotation with a deep squat, this is a good one to be able to get down deeper without having to sacrifice uh, abnormal postures uh, down in the deep squat.